all inside. It's never outside. It's never another person. It's never a condition or a circumstance. It's always like every day. This is such beautiful information. I've been living with it for a long time. I don't even know how to live without it. In fact, I don't think you can. He merely exists. And unfortunately, that's the way most people go through life. You see, our educational institutions have not given us the same kind of information. They really don't. They really believe the secret is read the book, remember what's in the book, and be able to repeat. Answer the questions more right than wrong. You'll pass, you get the degree. But we get people graduating from some of the most prestigious universities in the world every year with multiple degrees. They're in with every kind of work. They're broke. How does that happen? And yet you'll find other people who are functionally illiterate that can neither read nor write. They were earning millions. How do we account for this? You're going to find that out as you study this. It's got nothing to do with anything outside of ourselves. Education isn't answered what's in the book. Education comes from the Latin of Jupiter, meaning to reduce, to develop, or to grow within. Remember I said everything's already here, omnipresent? That's within us. Men in Montessori was right. Napoleon Hill was right. Carnegie knew the right question. Hill knew how to answer. What are you going to do with the rest of your life? That's your question. You're going to make the decision. We have here in the con subconscious the paradigm, and part of the paradigm with respect to money is it's a poverty point. Now, this paradigm impacts our thinking. There's a power flowing into our consciousness, and the thoughts we think are generally motivated by the subconscious mind. Now, something that I've been pointing out uh, here recently on, uh, look at this. The subconscious mind is universal intelligence. So when you have that paradigm in the subconscious mind, that controls the vibration that we're in, and the vibration we're in is going to dictate what we attract, because we're in that vibration here on a conscious level, on a subconscious level, and on a physical. So you're going to attract, from anywhere you go in the universe, the same type of thing. That's, that's what we're attracting. So we're attracting people that are in harmony with this, and this paradigm causes our thinking to be along the same level. Now, we've got to realize, even in our ignorance, when we don't know and we haven't got anything, our thinking is hooked into universal intelligence. And you will attract from wherever it is in the universe, whatever is required to cause the problem. When you hear people say, you know, I just get one bill, bill paid and another one pops up. Bang, they're going to attract it. And sure as it gets dark, they get it. Now that's ingrained in our mind from the time we're children. In fact, from the moment of conception in most of us. And then we grow into it, and that's what we hear as we're growing up. Money doesn't grow on trees, and, and over and over. You can't have everything you want, you know. And... That is, uh, that's got to be eliminated, and we've got to realize that is not fact. That you do not have to work harder. That you do less. And you earn more. And you've got to get the idea that you can have money coming in from many different places in the world, right in, right into you. You attract it. And you can magnetize yourself to money. In all different quantities. Though you cannot change conditions or circumstance, you don't have to let them control you. You can't control what's going on outside, but we can control what's going on inside. You know? And unfortunately, I don't think many of us have been raised to really understand that. And it's a lack of understanding that's causing all our problems. We are the only creature on the planet totally disoriented in our environment. All the little squirrels, um, birds, uh, every, all the animals are completely at home in their environment. They blend in. 
you and I are totally disoriented in our environment. We've been given the mental faculties to create our own environment. However, we go right through school and we've never learned that. Hmm. 